diversity growing up in hockey, um, there wasn't many brown skin, you know, players out there uh, like myself. I mean, there was, um, you know, uh, generally just, you know, Caucasian uh, players, uh, but, you know, that didn't affect me at all. Um, I didn't, didn't think that I was, you know, looked down any uh, less than or, or any coaches maybe counted me out in a certain situation. Um, so I think that helped being in California, too. I think different parts of the country have, um, you know, more racism or, or whatever the case may be, but obviously California is as open-minded as it gets and um you know i think the, the hockey community in california can be a little bit more conservative but uh you know for me it's just um you know no one really counted me out or, or you know knocked me because of my skin if, you know for me it's just about growing the game of hockey um you know whatever it takes to, to grow the game it's it's become uh, really as players have, have moved on become very territorial um, you know, it's, it's a lot of time for skill coaches, coaches in general, making it more about themselves than, than the players and their development. And I think that's got to shift over. Um, I don't think you're seeing the success that you probably did as far as cranking out NHLers uh, from my age group, maybe a couple of years older, the, the Grimaldi's, the, the, the Leo's and, and so on and so forth. Um, of course, we're seeing, uh, you know, the Yorks of the world or, you know, but it's it just it's it's I think more recently it's few and far between. And we got to shift back to uh, being on that upward trajectory as far as far as uh, pumping um, uh, elite level players out you know, from California. No matter if you're from Michigan or from Florida, California, you know, whatever the case may be, everyone's you know, looking for a fair shot. And um, I think, you know, me being uh, a part of the BIPOC program for the NHL uh, has opened up a lot of doors. Me going to the Anaheim Ducks uh, uh, development camp and main camp and, and being able to hit the ice with, uh, you know, the world's best is, is certainly a big opportunity for me. And, um, you know, it's just one of those things where, um, yeah, it, it's, it's been great. Just like anything, I mean, the world's diverse. I think everyone, you know, has should have the opportunity, uh, no matter what ethnicity, uh, you know, skin color, whatever the case may be, um, religion, uh, to, to have the same opportunity to um, grow as a person, uh, get better at something, have the opportunity to make uh, money. And yeah, I think everything, just like any other sector, um, whether it's sports or, or, or non-sports related, deserves a, a chance to, um, you know, have success. What others can do um, is just, you know, make people feel comfortable. You know, uh, if you have a, a teammate or whatever the case may be who comes from a different background, religion, um, you know, uh, help them out. You know that, uh, you know, they might feel different or, or in an environment that uh, they don't look the same or, um, you know, maybe when they go home, act, act the same. Um, so, uh, you know, I just think, you know, make everyone feel feel welcome.